Hello from Mykonos! Today we will be exploring the beautiful island of Mykonos. If you are new here, don't forget to like and subscribe to this video. We were on the Enchanted Princess and because we have a lead status with Princess, we were able to get priority disembarkation. So we were parked the furthest way down out of all the cruise ships. So we got on the sea taxi, which is two euros each way. There is a bus that I believe is 10 euros, but this is the view. We wanted a water view. It's Mykonos, it's what they're known for. You can see all the other beautiful ships here. And if you would like to sail the Mediterranean, make sure you check us out. Our details are right in the corner here. So after a, about a 10, 10 or so minute ride, we went into the poor area of Little Venice and took a taxi over to Beef Bar. This was our club choice of the day. Now I'm gonna tell you, if you're coming to Mykonos, it's gonna be expensive. So make your pick worth it. This place was beautiful. For $100, we got our two beach chairs with the umbrella. They brought over a little like bean bag thing for Olivia. And then of course there was a menu to order snacks and whatnot, but look how beautiful this place is. We picked it because it was not on all the other busy beaches. It was fairly secluded, quiet. So if you are looking for a relaxing spot in Mykonos, this is it. We passed Ornos Beach and all the others on the way here. This is about a 15 minute or so ride from Little Venice. They have this great dock that you can jump off just like Olivia did. The water is crystal clear. Now here are some pictures of the menus that they can serve either on the beach or up at the restaurant, which will be the last menu coming up here. Like I said, it is very expensive, but I will tell you the food is absolutely worth it. After we laid out, did some swimming, it was time to eat before heading back to exploring the little Venice area um, side of the town. And the views from up here are just incredible. The theming's gorgeous. It, it, I just can't say enough about this place. So without further ado, we have the calamari for an appetizer, which is fantastic. Olivia got these street tacos that were technically an appetizer, but that ended up being her entree. This steak was divine, probably a top five steak in my life divine. We definitely paid for it because like I said, it's expensive, but the food's incredible. The smoothest mashed potatoes I've ever seen in my life. And this dessert, this is their marble bar. This is a custom make cookie crunch caramel chocolate thing. It's absolutely incredible. We all split this. It was so good. I'm still dreaming about this dessert. I think because of the combination of like salty, crunchy, chocolate. It is so good. This is what it looks like on the inside. It's kind of like a glorified cookie Twix bar. We had it back to Little Venice because can you say you've been to Mykonos if you haven't gone to the windmills? And then after checking out the windmills, we did stop at a little spot. Keep in mind, I have a link down below for my out of office profile where you can see all of the places that we stopped in Mykonos. This is where those bars are, where people watch the sunset. After this, we walked into the Little Venice area and I just wanted to show you how cute these walkways are here in Old Town Little Mykonos here. It is so beautiful. Now remember, if you are looking to travel, I have a great guide down below that will show you how to save money on travel for, from airfare to hotels, cruises, and it's completely free. So make sure you check that out down below because especially if you want to go to a place like Mykonos or Greece in the summer, it's going to be pricey. So these are the best ways to save you some money. So after we did a little bit of shopping, we opted to head back to the port area a little sooner. We had a 8 p.m. call, but I mean, this was the line at like six. The sunset is probably one of the most beautiful sunsets I've ever seen in my life. It was absolutely gorgeous. I'd highly recommend trying out Beef Bar and the other places in this video. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave them down below. And we will see you on the next video. Thanks so much, guys. Have a great day.